Hey everybody, it's Blue Toad, and welcome back to Splatoon 3 with the big run, which happened a month ago from <laughs> when I'm actually recording this post-commentary. That's a bit sad to think about, but it's okay. It's been a time. <laughs> there's, there's a lot of stuff happening. But now, we're gonna do a few more runs, see how we go. I'm gonna try and beat the boss a bit more, which I'm pretty sure I've already done. I can't remember anything, apparently. But it's fine, we just need to keep alive. Keep on top of all the regular enemies spawning in. Ah, uh, but also the bosses. There's a- it's a big mix between, uh, regular enemies and bosses. They have to get- how did both of those fail? Must have exploded before they actually got eaten by the monster. The big boss fry thing. Also, that thing there that I was just trying to shoot, that green orb, was- is, um... What the storm? cloud spawns from, so if you can destroy that before it activates, you can actually stop the, the ink or I can't remember what they're actually called, ink storms from just like covering the ground and doing some damage, because you have to basically move out of the way, otherwise it's, it's gonna get you. Gonna get you please, not doing enough damage, but no we are, okay cool. Brella is an interesting choice for this. It's still crazy to me that every round has different weapons for every character. Just completely different. I'm not just shuffling around. Ah, uh, but we might be in a little bit of trouble here. We need a few more eggs. We have a few people down, but they're getting back up. We might be alright now. We just need to stay alive a little bit longer. Somebody's out in the middle of the death. Oh boy, and there's a lot of things here. We have enough eggs though, so we just need to stay alive. Just like that, I guess. I mean, it's still going, but still. Made it through. 30 eggs, that's pretty good. Also, uh, since I've been- since the big run, I've also done some regular runs. Which I haven't recorded, but I was- like, I had like 150 something <laughs> golden eggs, so it is possible. You just need to get really lucky. Really lucky, so basically you need to play a lot. So, anyway. High tide. So let's defend our base a little bit. And try and take care of the regular enemies as well as the big ones. Since there's just a lot of them. Oh boy. There's quite a few of those things that shoot missiles out, so we're gonna have to take them out. Well, if the other one could come closer, that'd be nice as well. Come on over there. Oh my goodness, there's so many things over that way. We're not gonna be able to get closer, so we're gonna have to back up a little bit. And just crowd control if we can. Nope, got crushed, crushed on the wall. Ah, there are two of those. That's not good. Okay, got rid of one. Trying to use... A splat bomb. Or, yeah, I don't know. I, I remembered the names and then I forgot them, so it's a real shame. Ah, uh, but there's a lot of stuff here. We need to get some of these golden eggs if we can. Try and get rid of some of the bosses as well. So much stuff. Everywhere. We need to support allies. There are two of those UFO things. I can't remember what they're called. Why can't I remember what they're called? I've played Salmon Run so much. I do not remember. I've managed to get a few more of the outfits since the big run as well. As you can see, I've got the other one at the, um, the big run at the beginning of March, so. Okay, everything's fine, everything's fine, everything's fine. It's just a thing shooting at me with a stingray. We only have 28, but that's okay. Also, you really need to have the, whatever the rank is above professional plus three to get 150 golden eggs, so. But there we go, that's round two. Time for round three. What tide are we going with? Mid at... Oh, oh, it's low tide, okay, cool. Well, we're gonna have to defend the middle then. Somewhat. Just so we can get the eggs into the basket. That's the tricky thing about the low tide. Is you have to be in the middle. To get stuff working, and that's the tough spot to keep control of. Oh, there's a big guy there that is gonna shoot stuff if we don't get rid of him. Somebody got rid of him, so that's good. Just need to get rid of the tenter missiles thing. It's one side, not the other side though. It's a bit hard to get both sides by yourself. It is possible though. There's another one of the big guys. Try and get rid of him. What's circling my feet? Am I crazy? I'm just, I think I'm just crazy. I'm seeing things. Ah, I missed that shot. Oh boy. Explosions. There's a lot of stuff here. Also, this charging 
weapon is interesting because I can't really use it up close. Unless I charge, which just takes a little bit. I think you charge if you're not moving or in the air, so you need to keep that in mind. As you do stuff. Oh boy, there's a lot of stuff here. Probably should use my special to get around. And it's wave three anyway, so we need to use our specials. Before the round's end, otherwise we're not going to be able to use them. Properly, we get another one back if we ever reach extra wave. That was a sad death in the moors of death. One player left. Somehow still alive. I don't know where the last player was. They're around. Also, we need so many more things. We do not have enough. We need to get stuff back now. I'm dead. Seven. Six. Five. Maybe. No, I don't think so. I'm getting crushed against this wall. It was not worth reviving me. Two more, maybe? One player left? Nope, that's a wrap. It was not going well. We were getting, we were getting pushed back a lot more than we could handle. Also, it keeps track of your high score on the screen. I didn't realize that. I, would, I, I should have realized that was there for the big run. That makes sense now. That makes so much sense. Anyway, let's do another round. I guess that's very helpful for future big runs, so I make sure I get like 150 high score if I can. I probably won't be able to get that high of a score, but I can try. I've only had that score like once in a regular run, and that was pretty lucky, so. You also probably have to play with other players that are also high rank, which I expect around a big run there would probably be good players with you. Although I'm not, I'm not entirely sure if you need, need other one. How, is there two in there? Or the, the other one? Did they just merge together? One big one. I don't know. Anyway. Man, I had some ideas from some weapons that I wanted to invent, basically. <laughs> that I have not talk, gone over because I've been busy. Where does the time go? Also, what is this madness? It's fine. We've covered both those. We just need to get rid of them now. There's a thing pushing me back. There's a thing here trying to steal these. I'm gonna throw that over there if I can. I might want to use my special here. Oh, there's three of these now. Also, if it, it, it can still hit you if you're up up high, even if you're not really in the range of the explosion. As long as you're in the circle, it still hurts you, which is unfortunate. Although it might depend on how high up. Maybe I don't know. I might be wrong about that. Uh, we need to take care of some of these bosses. There's a lot of stuff right now. I want to get rid of the Stingray, just to assist my allies. And then if I can get up this tower, I can get rid of these as well. The Storm thing is going to jump around a bit. We can shoot it while it's flying through the air. There's a big, big enemy over there shooting explosions. I just got rid of a Storm there, that's good. Uh, we have enough eggs, which needs to survive a little longer. And there'll be the end of round one. Look at all those eggs on that stack! It's crazy when you see how many eggs get taken away by the enemies. Because that just shows that it's really possible to get a high score, you just need to really somehow get it. It's it's tricky because they just get either taken away or you don't have time to get them anyway. So, but anyway, round two and we've got a splat roller. I'm not great with rollers, but I can try. Just need to hold them back if I can. Try and use my ink strategically. Uh, and also, if you have one of these things chasing you, you probably want to lead it in a way that's gonna get assist your allies so uh, there's quite a few things <laughs> let me try and help out a little bit oh boy getting pushed back I'm not using my roller very well right now but that's okay it's taking care of the enemies that thing is blocking the other thing oh boy this is fine oh there's so many things I mean it's not too bad but also I'm trying to get around and do some damage there's too many things blocking me from getting to it but it might help my allies at the very least Clear the area. Uh, we need to take care of some of these bosses. And if I was paying attention, I'd probably get that <laughs> bomb there. But nope. It's fine. It's so fine. Oh boy. Getting pushed back. That's not good. The knockback is crazy in Splatoon games. I still have to say that. Still not a fan of sp knockback in Splatoon. But it happens, whether you like it or not. There's a lot of golden eggs out. And about, but I don't think we're going to get any of them. Maybe? If I 
can try and assist my allies here to where we might be able to get some, but there are quite a few bosses and enemies. Out and about, and somebody's down. Have to wait for them to be available to get back up. Still quite a few golden eggs around, but yeah, I think we're gonna not have enough time for much more than this. Just need to survive a little bit. Look at all those eggs getting carried away. It's so sad to see. It's fine. 41 though, that's pretty good. Could have been better, but that's still pretty good. Not, not gonna complain about that. Okay. Oh boy, here we go. I still want to saw the, like, um, rails and sprinklers stuff that I talked about ages ago to be a thing. Oh, big guy. We need to take that out before he messes up everything. I have a charger here, which I'm usually not a fan of, but I can actually use it pretty well if I aim for the bosses, so. And I can use this point on the map to be basically be safe forever, so. Unless it's a, um... A zombies raid thing. I don't know what they're called. The thing where there's like tons and tons of them all charging one player. Ah, that other one just, the other person just got in trouble. I'm gonna place that down. It's wave three, so I might as well. Also, I think if you have a specific, um, no, it doesn't matter what outfit you have, you, you can actually see how many specials you have and how many specials other people have by the packets attached to their helmet. So, like, I saw one person there still had both of their specials, so they might, might want to pop those if we need them. I've still got one left, as you can see by the left side of my head helmet thing. If I'm ever out of the ink, I'm just jumping around to trying to live. I lived longer than the other person that just died, but it's fine. Might want to use my special if too many people go down. There's a lot of stuff happening right now. I might want to send it down anyway going to revive. There are so many bosses. So many bosses. Two people are down currently. I probably haven't noticed that at this point in time. Now I have. I'm trying to shoot manually though and that's not working. Uh, I don't think we're going to get enough golden eggs in time with one player left. In six seconds to go. I'm live. Well, that's not going to last much longer. I was trying to revive more players because that's all I could really do. Well, that, that's a wrap. 96, though. That's alright. If we had made it, we'd have had a pretty decent score. Getting getting 100 is a decent score, so... I think if you max out Executive VP, you have a lot higher chance of getting good stuff. Like, it's not just you reach that level and then you get that stuff. I think if you, like, overdo it, you also get more stuff, possibly. Or at least you're... I don't know, you might get better players. Which will give you a better chance, probably. But I don't know how exactly it works when you get to specific ranks, but I feel like... If you rank it to max and then keep keep going, it's pretty good, so... And also, that, that's a sign that you're playing well, so... All the things. So I can't remember if I said this or not, but I really think that the main plaza in Splatoon 3 is going to get flooded at some point and become a, uh, a big run. Uh, we have uh, Dark Tetra Duelies. Cool. Duelies are good. I don't think I'm great with these ones, but that's okay. Just got to paint this wall. We are mid-tide, so let's see how that goes. What's going on? Oh, it's that the, the stuff in the sky. Well, if we can uh, take out the enemies before they land. We can get a lot of golden eggs in this. This is actually one of the best events to get um, golden eggs up to 150, but you have to really take out the enemies before they land. If you focus on just taking them out, uh, usually somebody will clean them up. I can't say that, that that's a reliable strategy, but if that also means you're not going to have lots of enemies dropping and making things take longer, so... At the very least, it's pretty good. Also, that's there. I probably should do some damage to that. Just push that back a bit. Somebody's down. Getting pushed back, but it's okay. Hello, box thing. Boxes don't have the the golden eggs. The, um, the enemies dropping the boxes do. So you have to make sure you get them before they leave. Oh boy, this is not going well. One player left and we have half of the golden eggs. I don't think we're gonna make it because we have to do some more damage to, we have to like we have to take out more of the things dropping from the sky. 
I don't think we're gonna make it to round two. Especially with 25 seconds left. I mean, I'm trying. It's also that, which I might need to use my special for. So I'm gonna pop that. Just to make sure we're not worrying about that while we're trying to do the rest of this. It's also gonna help hopefully hit some other things. We might make it. Somehow. 23, 24. 25, 26. Wow, 27, 28. Wow. Considering how bad that was looking. I mean, I did have to pop my special to get that end to work out, but it worked out pretty well, so. Alright, high tide. Let's cover as much of the base as possible. We have a Grizzco umbrella, which is going to be very good for that. As you can see, we've basically got... Oh, somebody didn't realize high, what high tide meant. Because that's always how that works. Oh boy, there's a lot of enemies. Try and hit that, maybe. Nope, not enough. Back up. Okay, we're getting a little bit of control back, but we need to get that person revived so we can take a reverse of that. And there's this here as well. There's another big guy. There's a, a tank on the ground. I don't know what to call it other than a tank. It's kind of a tank. I'm gonna try and get the back of that. There we go. There's another one. Uh, there's also a tower. Also, this spot here, if you can use the wall, it's actually pretty, pretty useful. Like that. But I think I can take that out of my own, especially not that distance. I get that shark. I can't remember what any of these are called. I should really remember. It says on screen when they kill you what they are, and I don't remember ever. I need better memory. <laughs> How do I get better memory? Please, give me the secret cheat code to memory. Oh boy. Well, I don't think anyone has an incredible... Uh, people do have incredible memories, but it's very rare. Oh boy. Don't have enough ink. Gonna try and hold up a bit. So I can get rid of that. There we go. It's almost worth using a special to just to get some control back. But, mm, we're too close to the end of the round to really do that now. Let's just get what we can and go for it. Gonna try and support with this Brella. Brella is very good for supporting people if they need to get back. Because you can cover the ground that they need to pass through. But anyway. Round three. And we have a splatter shot. I think it's mid tide. Right? Yeah, it's mid tide. I wasn't paying enough attention to see the thing on screen. Ah, there's like three bosses already. We need to take these out. There's a tower and a shark, so let's get rid of that. Two, tow two towers and a shark, and also the UFO. There's probably some other stuff spawning behind me. There's another shark. There's so much stuff. Oh, there's a stack. Oh, I'm dead. No, I'm not. Somehow. But I'm not going to be able to last long, so I'm going to just take this out and then jump, because the shark is going to get me. Otherwise. It really tried. Wow. I'm going to try and get it if I can. Thank you. I'm just trying to survive right now. If I can get this thing to pick up the eggs from the top of the tower and then kill it, you'll actually drop the eggs down, which is actually more helpful than leaving them up there. Ah, uh, there's a UFO. There's a big thing. Also, the UFOs are very helpful if you can get them to slam on the other bosses, so... But you have to be strategic about that. And sometimes you want to let the thing get up before it drops down again, so you can actually get that to work. It's hard to communicate that with other players, though, because, yeah. You know, let me revive quickly and see if I can get some of these eggs. I probably want to take out the UFO, though. There's also a big guy right there. There's t t multiple big guys right there. Oh, boy, I'm going to send that flying. I might die. I might go down here. Oh, there's, there's so much. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. I'm somehow still alive. The teammates are really pulling through. I'm going to have to use my special here, otherwise we're not going to get this. Come on. Okay, we have enough. We just need to survive. 28. I think that's as much as we're going to get. I, although that huge stack in the background is so sad to see. Anyway. That's the end, I guess. No extra wave. Not yet, anyway. 90, that's a decent enough score. I, don't, I, don't, I mean, that's what you'd usually get, so... But I would have loved to see 100 out of that. Considering how many bosses there were, we should have had a lot more golden eggs.
Okay, here we go again. Let's see if we can make it to extra wave, which means we have to survive the whole round and then see how we go in the extra wave, so. But I think we can do it. Got a Grizz Crab Brella, so let's try and cover up as much the middle as possible. There's no competition for coverage when it comes to the Grizz Crab Brella, so. It's just not great for specifically sh aim shots, so. Just have to kind of crowd control with it. If you can. Although you have to, I also have to manage ink, so. Oh boy. Uh, yes. I might want to get around this thing if I can. It's targeting somebody else, so let's try and help them out. You have to keep that in mind when you have those going around, because it means that somebody's basically running away until that gets taken out. Effectively, they're down until you help them by taking out the boss. Okay, probably want to just shoot that when it pops out of the ground. We don't need to use a bow on that. It was just, it was that close to being defeated anyway, so. Oh boy. There's a storm there that I'm ignoring apparently, trying to just take out the bosses instead. Oh boy, oh boy, how am I here? I don't know. I'm gonna try and get into a better position. High ground. So to speak, I can take out this big boss because I'm up here, so let's do that. There's also gonna be some ground to cover in a second. If I can head back, but I'm not gonna do that apparently. I'm gonna be sticking around here trying to get eggs back into the base. Uh, there's a lot of bosses. I might want to use my special so I can take some of these out. Or I can just take them out like this, I guess. Oh boy, that was a bad move to go forward, but that's okay. Uh, we have to last a few more seconds. I don't think I'm gonna get this back, unfortunately. That's okay. No, I got it back. Cool. 27 out of 23. That's a pretty good start. There's a lot of stuff we could have done, though, if we had managed to control the bosses. Now, I'm not sure, but I th I, I, I'm not sure if bosses spawn less if you get close to the end of a round, or if they just, like, stop spawning after a point. It'd be helpful to know that, but I, I don't know. I don't pay attention. Not entirely, anyway. I feel like they do, like, stop spawning after a point, though, so you, if you can take out all the bosses, then you can do the rest of the cleanup after that. Oh, hello. That's an odd spot for you to be in. Oh, boy. Gonna take my time here. Or not. Cool. Also, when the regular enemies knock out the bomb out of the circle, it's really annoying. Got spotted by the charm. Let's see if we can get revived. Thank you. I need to get these in. Also, need to control the crowd a lot more than this. It's wave two, so if I could use my special, that'd be great. Although I usually try to save my special as much as possible. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, I'm getting crushed in the corner. Steel eel. I should try to remember this. Steel eel. Steel eel. It's like trying to remember a name. I mean, that's exactly what that is, but you know what I mean. You have to really, really focus on the name to remember it. What? The explosion from the steel head got me. That is so unfortunate. And I'm over here now. We're not making it far. Unless we are. The people are popping their specials now, except that they're up there, 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 there. This is not going great, but we might be able to get enough just to survive. I've, I'm using my last special because we're this close to death. Just trying to try and pop some more stuff. Get whatever we can back to the base. 22 out of 25. 23. 24. One second left. Nope, that's a wrap. <laughs> okay then. Well, that was to be expected, I guess. We were really struggling. I don't know how many specials left. Okay, there were three specials left. I can see them now. I mean, there might not have been great specials. That actually looks like there's another special anyway. On the other person. But yeah, the, some of the specials aren't that helpful. <laughs> to be honest. I mean, they can be if you use them right, but it really depends. Let's go for another run. See how we go. Have all of our specials packed up nicely for when we need to use them. We have our ink brush. Interesting. I mean, it's not as good as uh, the, the umbrella for covering all the ground, but it is alright. 
Uh, but it can be good for close-up con uh, conflict, so. Let's do a whole bunch of that. <laughs> Somehow still alive. Just need to make sure we watch our ink. Try and get the other side. Nice coverage. Bosses are being dealt with. Same with the regular enemies. Although we're going to have to do something about the other side in a second as well. We're fairly, fairly well split up at the moment. Which sometimes it's good to stay together and sometimes it's good to split up. Oh, that was too early. We should have waited so I could drop it on stuff. That's fine. Oh, I revived already. That was quick. Even if you don't get the golden egg to the basket immediately, just getting... Picking it up is good, so just focus on what's important. Also, let's use some specials. I know it's wave one, but still. Okay, let's get you. Oh my goodness, I nearly died if I didn't move. Uh, we can also run on places that we not, normally wouldn't be able to run using the ink brush. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. Look at all this stuff. Let me try and cover this for you. Thank you. You're welcome. I don't know who I'm talking to or what I'm saying. It's fine, there's a lot of stuff. We have enough eggs, but there's still a lot of bosses that we could be taking on right now, which people are. We might better get a good score on this. We have 35 so far, so that's really good. I should be focusing on the boss, but I'm not for some reason. It's fine. 40? That's very good. Very, very good round. We did pop a special, but I think it was worth it. For the score, at least. I don't know about lasting out this whole thing. That's okay. Looks like we have a spider shot of some kind. No dapple doolies. It's hard to actually see what's in my hands. I should just look at the squids at the top left. Okay. There's a boss. There's another boss. There's another boss. Oh my goodness. Well, we covered that. We covered that, apparently. Just need to take out some of these enemies. And not get cornered. And not corner myself. Okay. It's fine, there's another boss. Oh, there's another enemy. That was pushing me forward. <laughs> That's not great. Just gonna cover some ground, try and take this thing out on my own, since everyone else has probably not got enough ink. It's okay. Also, if you're next to the... If you can, try and deposit eggs manually without throwing them. That's also probably a good plan. If you need to throw them, do that. But also, if you can hold, just hold them and deposit them manually, it's also really helpful. Uh, there's a lot of stuff here. Let me try and deposit it if I can. I just need a lot more ink. We have an escape wall if we need it, so let's try and use that. Like that. And we need to take out some of these bosses. Let's do a bit of that. And now for the bit of... No, hang on. There's bosses. Pay attention to me. Oh, I got got by the moors. I did not realize that was called moors. But that will probably be pretty easy to remember. <laughs> Oh boy, I'm getting pushed forward by the boss. That's actually something else you need to keep in mind when you're playing. If you can get pushed forward by the enemies while you're dead, it can be very helpful for getting to your allies faster. I do not want to be here. I need to recharge my health. <laughs> you know, that's how that works. We have 31 out of 24, so we have enough golden eggs, but can we get more? Probably not. There's too much chaos at our base right now, so... Wave 2 clear, and we still have another special, so that's pretty, pretty good. Wave 3 should be manageable, so... Let's see how this goes. Got a... Grisco Brellus. Let's see how much we can cover with this. Oh my goodness. Really? That's the worst, when you just go a little bit too early. And get pushed down. Okay, there's a ton of stuff already. Let's try and focus on bosses if we can. I don't know if I'm going to be able to actually focus on bosses, because this is in the past, but... If I was as good then as I am now, <laughs> I don't know how to describe that any better. Please focus on the big... Nope. Get out of the way and cover some ground so we can get the other boss. Nice. That was well executed. Although we need to focus on this large group of enemies now. Saw a shadow of a thing. Oh boy, I'm going to try and get to high ground. That was probably worth it. It might be also be worth using a special in a minute, maybe, if people are struggling. It's fine. Uh, this is not a great position to be holding onto these eggs to try and get back to the base. Oh boy. It's fine, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. Might be worth specialing, maybe? 
I'm very tempted in the future. Oh! That could have ended badly. There was a lot of stuff there. Wow. Oh, boy. Stingray. Ah, uh, special. Definitely special. Please. Please me, special. Oh, please, special. Please, what are you doing? Ah, special. <laughs> There's so much stuff. I'm just trying to take it on manually, I guess. There we go. Special, finally. When I was backed into a corner, I should have done it like 10 seconds earlier, but that's okay. At least I used it. Okay, someone used their crab. Crab for good and not for evil. There's a lot of stuff there that's not getting deposited, but that's okay. We managed to get through with 32 out of 26, but also... I think it's extra wave time. Emergency. And of course, it could only be Horrorboros for this big run, so... I still think Horrorboros' design is really cool. It's such a good addition. I can't wait for whatever's next, if they do another big run at some point. Oh, it's right above us. I might want to try and get in front of it if I can. Although I'm trying to focus on bosses right now. But if I can hit its thing in its mouth while it's there and make that explode, it does a ton of damage, so. And I have a slosher, I think. So if I can do that, that'd be really good. Because slosher's good for that, I would imagine. Uh, it's coming around. Let me just get up here and see what I can do. Why am I aiming it that way? Probably because its thing is already broken. Um, I want to use my special, maybe? I still have that. So hit the thing, hit the thing, hit the thing. There we go. That's what I'm saying. If you can use that, do that with your, um... What's it called? I need to move. Slosher, that's pretty good, sir. So. Need to revive. We have done most of its health already. We have 40 seconds left, so I think we're going to make it through. This is the second time I think I've done this, sir. So. If I'm not mistaken. And I'm pretty sure I got through this both my first and second times doing this. Oh boy, one player left. I might be wrong. Nope, we're good. Just a little bit more. Just a little bit more. We just need to do some damage to it and then we, we're we done. Basically, just regular shots. Just hit it. There we go. Like that. Perfect. Wave clear. It's going to revive because that's usually what people like doing at the end. <sighs> Back to the helicopter. Fuel isn't free. Well, there we go. And now that's the end of the big run, so. And that's my high score of 105, so. I guess, although I have had more than that in regular rounds, so. Special report, fresh news, never frozen. Oh, gimme, gimme, gimme. The salmon needs that invaded Inkblot Art Academy have been sent back to sea. Are you serious, big man? Not that I had any doubt. Another win for us in the books. Well done, team. Haha, <laughs> yeah, we rule. So where's the thank you gift? Are they mailing it directly? It sounds like Grizzco is checking the job logs. Hold on to your seahorses. So now we have to wait a bit for, before it gets released. Which is okay, because I live in the future. And I can play the next part already. In three, two, one. Before we get to the current battle stages, I have an announcement. I am, I am, because the big run results are in. Ooh. Really, Grisco sent a letter. Why don't you let me read it? Thank you for participating in our official big run. We appreciate the support and have prepared a small token of gratitude. What is it? What is it? E. Okay, so the top scores. The top 5%, we get gold. And 20% is silver. I guess we also probably need more than these in other runs. Looks like an eye-wateringly high scores. Whatever rank we had, we get that um, that theme for the the statue thing we get. Thanks to everyone who fought us the Salmonids at Inkblot Art Academy. Truly a climatic... Uh, I don't know what word that was. We scored them, taught them a lesson, made them think. Speaking of art, this reminds me, we've been neglecting my own projects lately. Uh, yeah, we used to be quite a painter, didn't you? Win a contest? That's right, it was an abstract painting of the great zapfish, so creepy and cool. The subject of the painting was my art teacher. <laughs> cool. But anyway, that is it for now, so thank you all for watching, and I'll see you all next time. Also, there's a Splatfest. I think it's the beginning of next month, so be ready for that.
And if you want to keep up to date with Splatoon stuff, um, I'd, I'd recommend following one of the nin- official Nintendo accounts on Twitter. So that's where I keep updated. So it's going to be more helpful than me. So anyway, bye bye.